Greetings guys, this is Magnani Mas Mainz Lectures Online. Today we start with a new series of uh, electronics N5 videos. And now we look at uh, balance three phase systems. Here we are given a question which involves like efficiency. It says a 400 volt three phase delta connected motor is coupled to a DC generator which on full load provides a power output of 10 kilowatts. The efficiencies of the generator and the motor are 85 and 90 percent respectively and the motor power factor is 0 0.88 lagging. Calculate the full load condition. A it says calculate the line current of the motor. B says calculate the phase current of the motor so uh, the first thing to like look at here it, is that uh, they are saying a motor is coupled to a DC generator which means that this motor is actually uh, this motor is actually running this generator not the other way around. The generator is not running the motor. The motor is running the generator. And then this power output is for the generator. This one. And then for us to find the line current of the motor, that means we've got to find the input power of the motor. And how do we do that? That means from this output power of the generator, using the efficiency of the generator we calculate the input power of the generator and then that input power of the generator it's from the motor meaning that the very same input power of the generator will be the output power of the motor and then using that output power of the motor and the efficiency of the motor we can calculate the input power of the motor. Then from the input power of the motor, uh, we can calculate the current using the voltage of the motor and also the power. So we're given V of the motor as 400 volts, power factor of the motor is 0 0.8. Eight, eight. and then the efficiency of the generator uh, there's not efficiency let me write it as uh, efficiency of the generator will be oh, we are given as 85 percent and then the efficiency of the motor is uh, 90 percent and then the power output of the generator is 10 kilowatt so using the efficiency formula which is uh, efficiency cost to p out over p in we can calculate uh, P in. So to get the P in of the generator, we are going to see P out, which is 10 kilowatt over 85. Sorry. Over 85 percent and then we get uh, one one seven six four point seven one watts and that's our p in for the generator and then 
our p in for the generator equals to our p out of the motor therefore our p in of the motor equals to our p out of the motor which is uh, this value so it's going to be 11764.71 over the efficiency of the motor which is 90 percent equals to 1301.9 watts then this is the input power of the motor so with this input power of the motor that's when we can use uh, the formula for power and calculate uh, the i line that we are looking for and let's go ahead and do that uh, i'll need a little bit of space so i'll erase this and move forward so using the p in for the motor v l i l cos we calculate i l so we'll make i l subject of the formula then it's going to be i l equals to p in of the motor over square root vl then this this is the power factor and we are given so I'll write it as the power factor right here instead of writing cos theta then we substitute what we are given so it's going to be one three zero seven one point nine over uh, square root of 3 times 400 times uh, 0.88 then this gives us 21.44 amps and this is our line current and then to get our uh, phase current we know that uh, i line equals to square root 3 i phase then phase current equals to i l over square root of 3 which is 21.44 over square root of 3 and it gives us phase current of 12.38 amps and that's it for this question thanks for watching our videos please do subscribe to our channel as well as liking our videos also do follow us on our social media platforms for further updates on the video we have just posted or posting on facebook we are magnanimous minds instagram magnanimous minds twitter at magnanimous